Hi everyone, it's Darla from Crafty Yarn Owl. Welcome. So how's everyone doing? I'm doing okay. I'm doing okay. I had a I had a dentist appointment yesterday. I needed a filling. I haven't had a cavity for five years. As soon as Hubby and I stop eating all that sweet stuff, I get a cavity. And he got a cavity too. <laughs> Isn't that weird? <laughs> He had his filled a couple of weeks ago, so, yeah, um, yeah, so anyway, that's done, that's done. That kind of wore me out because I have, um, a panic disorder, so, you know, to have people with their fingers in your mouth, and there's gauze in there, and there's tools in there, you know, it's like, oh, God, please don't let me have a panic attack. Anyway, I, I did good, and, you know, the Lord answers prayers, so... Yeah, thank you, God. <laughs> so, um, so I'm I'm feeling okay. I was tired a little while ago, but I'm I'm feeling a little bit better because I watched Pamela at Pamela's Adoring Crochet. Hi, Pamela. I had sent her a card. She showed it on her channel, a, a handcrafted card, and um, I love you too, girl. <laughs> so, she she always lifts my spirits somehow. She's just such a kind kind lady and uh, I really love you Pamela okay so I decide okay I'm gonna do a video because <laughs> I feel good now <laughs> um, yeah so anyway I I am working on a tutorial for a cardigan and um, I think I showed you the start of it last week it's a raglan style so it's real easy like the body's one piece and uh, I think I'm gonna do short sleeves on this one but hang on a minute I have something else to show you all right so I um, I am down to the border part and uh, yeah, I have to see where I'm at I had to frog and then redo some of it but anyway I'm down to the border part at the bottom there and um, so yeah this is what it looks like right now this is the back so yeah so the yarn the yarn I'm using for this is the Hobie Tea Time and I had done an unboxing on it and um, it was 750 US so I forget what that is in Canadian, but uh, our prices are always higher. Um, so the Hobie Tea Time, it was new out at the time and $7.50 US a ball, and um, which was half price. So I had grabbed four different colors, I think it was, and I did an unboxing. I'll link it, uh, where am I? Up here? Up here? Oh, wherever. All right. Um, so it's a four weight, they call it a four weight, but um, it's actually roving style. So it goes, you know, it's thin and then the yarn will go a little thicker, but at the thick parts, it doesn't seem like it's a four weight to me. It's a, maybe it's a four weight, but to me it's a thin, thin four weight. I don't know, do I have something I can show you? I sh like, I don't know if that's the four weight part. <laughs> Yeah, it's a roving style. It is really, really nice to work with, but if you need to frog, like I said, I had to do some frogging. It's got a bit of fuzz. I don't know if you can see the fuzz on the camera, but there's a little bit of a fuzz, uh, and it's a little hard to frog. Um, yeah, a little hard. It's not impossible. You know, you go slowly, um, but it is a little hard to frog. But other than that, it's a really nice yarn to work with. Okay, so let me tell you about it. 100% acrylic, 200 grams, 7.1 ounces, 580 meters, 634 yards. Now, right now with this sweater, and I'm about a large, um, I am just so far here with all this that I've done. That's where the short sleeves are going to go. But with all that I've done, right to the length I want it to be, and then I'm doing the border, um, that's not even a whole ball. 
and I'm using a 5.5 millimeter hook. This is the end of the first ball. Yeah, so pretty good, right? And I think I bought three colors, three balls of each color. Don't look at my hair. <laughs> I need a haircut and dye job so bad, <laughs> but whatever. Um, so yeah, it's, oh, what else was there? Uh, it suggests a 5.5 millimeter hook, and that's what I'm using. And let me see. Of course, I'll give all these details when I do the tutorial. Oh, color is 11, so it's got teals and purples, and it's like, it's gorgeous. Gorgeous colors. I love it. All right, so I was going to mention, um, oh, it's made in India. Made with love in India. Sometimes people like to know where yarns are made. So, yeah, so again, that's the Hobie Tea Time. And even though they have a color number here on their site, it does say the name of the colors. And uh, they're all named after tea, which I thought was really cool. But you know what? I do wish they had sent a tea bag with each ball of yarn with the tea that corresponds to the, to the colorway. <laughs> that would have been fun. Okay. Okay. So I have another... Um, Another whip, and this one is exactly the same, except, except, my plan is to turn this the right way to show you. Okay, it's exact same thing. That is really showing up a gorgeous uh, royal blue. I mean, it is blue royal blue and it's got little bits of green in there and, I, and some very very few spots oh of um let's see purple oh like a purpley you see that very beautiful yarn um so this one is also classified as a four weight but it definitely is a thick thicker four weight i would say or maybe this is standard I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, it's the same pattern, but on this one, I'm going to make long sleeves. So I'm going to show you how to make the short sleeves in the tutorial and how to make the long sleeves. I mean, they're pretty much the same. Pretty much the same. <laughs> but anyway, so I am working on that tutorial. And I'm not sure when it will be out. Okay, but it will be. <laughs> Okay, so this, this yarn was given to me by our beautiful Barbara Leanhard. Hi, Barbara. She's, she's such a wonderful um, uh, subscriber and friend, and like all of you are. And um, so she had sent me this yarn for my birthday in November, and this is I Love This Yarn print. And Hobby Lobby yarn. We don't have Hobby Lobby in Canada. Mm -hmm. So it's 100% acrylic, uh, 5 ounces, 142 grams, 252 yards, 230 meters. And she has sent me four. Four. So I'm still on the first ball. That's what I have left of the first ball. I'm not quite to the length I want it to be, but almost there. Yeah, so, yeah. Um, so what else, what else does it say? Medium four, this one says 5.5 millimeter hook, and that's what I'm using. Same size as that other, that Hobie yarn I just showed you. What am I forgetting? Sea Muse is the color. And it's beautiful, and it's working out so nice. Have you guys used this yarn? I love this yarn. Or have you bought any of the Hobie Tea Times? What do you think? If you bought these, what do you think about them? I looked at them the other day because uh, I saw an ad or something and they were like, I think $15 for one. It's like, wow, I'm so glad I got them at half price. Maybe you guys did too. Did you get them when they were on a really good deal? I hope you did. I hope you liked them. Uh, I'm not affiliated or anything. Okay, this 
what else was there something else where is this made uh, does it say made in turkey yeah i love this yarn is made in turkey yeah so i hope i didn't forget anything but um yeah, so I guess that's it for this video, and I am working on the tutorial for this sweater. I love these little sweaters because you can just throw them over top of a tank top and, you know, run to the yarn store. Well, maybe not in February, but <laughs> in Canada especially. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, or if you need a little extra layer under your winter jacket or your lightweight jacket, they're, they're just great. Yeah, I like, I actually like to wear my crochet items to Michael's because uh, once in a while, once in a while, somebody will say, oh, I love your top or your sweater. It's like, oh, I have a tutorial on YouTube. <laughs> shameless, shameless self-promotion. <laughs> anyway, yeah, it's kind of cool when you walk out of there with a couple more subscribers. <laughs> Hi to all the subscribers that have subscribed from Michael's. And wherever you're from, thank you, everyone. All right, um, I guess that's it. Yeah, so um, I'll see you all again as soon as I can. All right, you guys take care. Thank you for joining me today. And let me know what's on your hook and if you've used this yarn. All right, what other, what other um, craft, craft uh, hobbies do you have? Um, or not even hobbies, maybe you, maybe you have a business. Yeah, <laughs> but anyway, I've, I've been doing a little bit of paper crafting, but not that much because I've been doing these. <laughs> all right, guys, thank you so much, and I'll see you all again soon. Okay, bye. Am I still on? I am.